Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, my name is Chelsea and I do videos with my boyfriend Dan. Uh, we do random videos together. I do videos on midwifery, travelling, random bits and bobs. But today, via the title, you can see this is my birthday haul for what I got for my 24th birthday. Which was yesterday, but when you're watching this, it's like a couple weeks ago. I don't know, but it was 21st of March. Um, I do have balloons here. But you can't see them, but this was one of the ones we got, it just says birthday snuggling. And then we got a two and a four balloon up there. Um, and I also got a cake made, I will try and insert the pictures of the balloon and the cake here somewhere. Uh, but my boyfriend got them done for me from two small businesses. Uh, the cake was made by Monique's Treat. the troubles of living with a boyfriend who's very loud <laughs> um yeah the cake was made by someone called Monique Streets on Instagram check her out and the balloons were done by balloons by Barretto I think um so yes very lovely um yeah they're based in London obviously because that's where we live so yeah definitely recommend if you want to use them they've got Instagram so check them out um but I thought I would show you guys what I got for my birthday so, I'll start with the cards. So I got a bunch of cards. So I got this one from my mum. It came today, so it's a bit late. So let's face it, even the bin has more has more chance of going out on your birthday this year. <laughs> Which is so funny. Um, and then Dan got me a funny one as well. He said, you must wear a face mask in public and with a face like yours I'd consider wearing it at home too because he's rude and very cheeky. Um, and then he also got me some more cards. He got me these two. So this one says, it says enjoy your special day Annabelle because he forgot to change the name. So he's lucky I'm not very um, non-trustworthy of him basically. But it has this cute picture inside of us. And then you got this one as well, it's for my wonderful wife, happy birthday snuggles. And this has a picture of us as well when we went to Casper's in 2019. Um, and then I got this card from my beautiful sister. Yeah, from my sister and her husband, my brother-in-law. Uh, I got this one from my other sister and her children well they're more like grown-ups now but then I got this one that says happy birthday to you this was from my aunt and uncle and cousins I got this one from my godparents um, I got this one that says a fabulous friend from my mum's friend Rona she's like a second mummy to me she's lovely I love her uh, and then I had uh, have have a yummy scrummy birthday. This was actually from Monique's treats. She gave me a card. She's lovely. She works with Dan. So um, then I got birthday wishes just for you. And this one was from my nieces and nephews, Emily, Riley, and Lolo. And then I got this one from my dad. It just got a picture of us two in it. And yeah. So um, I will show you like the food sauces and drinks. So my dad got to me this Tesco pack of 12 cupcakes, um, it's got hidden centres, so you've got the salted caramel ones, chocolate ones and strawberry ones, so they look very yummy, uh, so I will be partaking in these, they've got a good date though so they don't go off till the 10th of April, so yes. And then he also got to me a bottle of Lambrini. So I'll be drinking this, it's lightly sparkling perry, so it's original. So yeah, I'll be enjoying that. I don't think I've tried that one, so. Uh, we'll go on to, like, accessories, I suppose. I don't even know where the other thing's gone. Oh, here we go. So, Dan got me a beautiful crown. I should actually wear it, shouldn't I? So I was wearing this all day yesterday, but I forgot to wear the birthday queen sash, but it's rose gold birthday queen sash, and I did have a badge, but I couldn't find the badge, so 
I've got it for my next birthday. <laughs> um, so I'll show you this next. So this I got a scratch off UK map. Um, I've got the European map and the world map. Yeah. So I wanted the UK one because obviously there's loads of places in the UK that I want to go to. But I don't want to just scratch the whole of the UK off. I actually want to scratch the places in the UK I've been. And these are watercoloured ones. So I've got two watercoloured ones. Um, yeah. And I think the watercolour makes it look extra nice. And yeah, so I've got a whole little area at the bottom of our stairs uh, where I have these. So this is the last one to add to the collection. So my baby, my beautiful Dan, got this for me. So, yes. Uh, and then I got these boots. <gasps> How nice are they? They've literally got like mini Mickey Mouses all over them. And they're so nice. They are £25 from George at Asda, but we got them when they was on sale for £20, so I think they should still have them, but I thought these were lovely to wear with, like, black ripped skinny jeans and, like, a black leather jacket with a nice top, so, yeah, that was my idea when I wanted these, so they're really nice. Uh, and then Dan got me this cute, oh, yeah, Dan got me those as well. The present I'm showing you is what Dan got me, so, yeah. And he got me this beautiful elephant. He said it was the last one and he literally searched all the boxes that were out. He got this from Morrison's. I thought it was so cute. I love it. He knows how much I love elephants, so. Yeah. And the cupcakes and the alcohol came from my dad, so. Yeah. Um, okay. So as I said in the title, it's pretty much a midwifery haul, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> so, I already have the labour one and the antenatal one so Dan got me the rest of the collection of the midwifery essentials so I got the postnatal one the emergency maternity care medical conditions the basics infant feeding and antenatal no so I didn't have anything. I have labour and public health, I think. Yeah, labour and public health I got already. So I got these ones. And this is actually the books I got today. Are the first books I've actually ever had that's new and fresh for my midwifery collection. Because I obviously I buy them cheap second hand. So yeah, it's nice to actually have a fresh one. And you just that smell of a new book. That book is, that smell is just amazing. I love it. Um, yeah, and then he also got me two Pandora vouchers, so £20 each, um, yeah, so I'm going to try and find some discounts online so that I can get a few charms, because uh, uh, you can find discounts online and stuff that you can get more from, so I'm going to try and get a few, um, charms out of these so yeah this is really nice and i love my pandora charm bracelet i actually want to start wearing it more but i just get so scared about breaking it so obviously i won't wear it to work but i will start wearing it when i go out and stuff because it's such a beautiful bracelet and i've got so many charms now so yeah have to add to the collection <laughs> and then the last thing dan got me was <laughs> this coloring book it's called hashtag OB life, which is objects and I actually don't know what the B stands for, but yeah, a snarky coloring book for adults. So it says, hey guys, I'm just over here trying to survive night shift and not get fat. Um, I don't always watch medical shows, but when I do, I point out every single medical inaccuracy. Um, else is there in here um, code brown does not mean someone bought chocolates um, so see you later of you later um, Don't overreact with the crying um, ovaries. So yeah, 
is really funny and I think it's a cool book to have. I've also got like a colouring book on pregnancy and labour and stuff which is cool but I thought this was so funny and I love colouring and it's nice to have something to kind of chill when you're having a stressed day and you just want to have a pamper evening so yeah um i will show you Ooh, i need to go downstairs actually and grab something else because there are other things one other thing that dan got me and something that my niece is a nephew got me but the other thing my sister got me was this notebook and it's so cute it's just a student midwife at your cervix and then inside it's just got lined paper and i just think it's lovely and so sweet and will help me with my midwifery journey so yeah um i'll show you what my dad got me because he got me the cupcakes and the alcohol but he also got me two books that i asked for so he got me the skills for midwifery practice book which is obviously the newest edition um yeah great book uh, apparently this one's really good um, for your midwifery journey, uh, you know, your degree, so. And then I also got this little mouse pocket reference for midwives, which is really nice. Apparently this is great to leave, leave in your scrubs pockets and stuff to have on placement with you just to quick have an overview and stuff. So let me open it and see what it looks like inside as i was saying it i've opened it now so this is it so this is what it looked like inside um so obviously that is a breech birth baby in the womb baby coming out and stuff so yeah it's a cool handy guide it's basically just a miniature version of the miles textbook so i pretty much have the whole collection now I just need to get the workbook and I'll be done. But I don't have the newest the Miles textbook. I have the last edition because I prefer the maids. So I'm probably one of the odd ones out that prefers maids over Miles. But, you know. So then I'll show you the last two things from my nieces and nephew and my baby boyfriend. So he got me this mug that says Snuggles with a little elephant on it. And it's so cute because obviously my nickname is Snuggles. And I love elephants, so that was perfect. And then my sister got from my nieces and nephew this mug that has an elephant on it, and it's Auntie Chelsea. And it's so cute because, like, she didn't realise that she's never actually bought me anything that says Auntie on it, apart from, well, like, for Christmas she made me an Auntie key ring with Minnie Mouse on it. Um, and then obviously now she's bought me a mug, so yeah. <laughs> But I thought it was well cute and I love it. So we'll be using those. I don't use mugs often but I feel like they're cute so I should start using them. <laughs> um, okay, so then the last free stuff I have is from my mummy. So my mum got me this book, Square in the Circle. Um, I've heard good stuff about this book. Um, yeah, it's by Zoe Downing and she and room and it's basically a collection of the latest research and debate on normal childbirth so yeah so yeah this is obviously very it's a very wordy book obviously but loads of people have said they've used this for their essay writing and stuff so yeah um hopefully it will come in good handy so i thought i'd get that one and then the other textbook she got me was the at atomy, anatomy and physiology of midwife textbook um this is obviously the newest edition as well and it's brand new because it's got the packaging on uh but let me open it and show you it's actually quite smaller than what i thought it was gonna be so yeah um that's what it looks like inside it's obviously got like pictures and stuff as well as um, writing but it's got diagrams and all that on it so it's just basically a whole book on anatomy and physiology but like the parts that are connected to midwifery basically and pregnancy and beyond so yeah 
That one's one that's been recommended to me by lots of people in the middle of 3 degree too. And then the last thing I got my mum to buy me, which is actually hilarious because what 24 year old asks for this, that like this is what I would have got for when I was 5, but it's a baby dolly! So I went for the baby Annabelle little Alexander, so this is basically her little brother. As you can see, it's tampered with because my niece, who is nearly, she's going to be five in May, has decided that she wanted to play with him yesterday. So she got him out of his box, so he's not fresh, but it's fine. But when I saw, I thought this size was the perfect size to have because he's so dinky and tiny and cute. Uh, there was a girl one, but I preferred the boy, and his name's Alexander, which is what I would have called my son, like his middle name. And also named after my granddad, because uh, my granddad was called Alexander. So I thought it would be nice, and it's like he's helping me with my degree. Um, but he's so cute, and he's so tiny as well, which means like he can fit in my like um, backpack when I'm going to uni and I need a dolly for the day. So yeah, he's so tiny, but he's so cute. And he came with this little bottle that you can like put in his mouth. But obviously... I would be using him for breastfeeding support, like to do the breastfeeding. And also, I'm going to draw on his little head, bless him. So I'm going to draw all on his head so I can practice and learn everything about it. So yeah, he's cute. So I got him for my birthday as well. Not a normal present to ask from, from your mum for your 24th birthday. We all know that, but it's all good. It's all fine. So, yes. That was everything I got for my birthday. I felt very spoiled and loved, um, and I love everything I got. A lot of the stuff, obviously, I did ask for. I asked for the books, obviously, and the boots. Yeah, but everything else was a surprise, obviously. Um, but yeah, I love everything I got. Um, really appreciated, obviously. But I wanted to show you guys what I got, and obviously, it relates to midwifery as well, because it's pretty much a whole midwifery haul. <laughs> apart from a few bits um but yeah so i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a like subscribe to our channel and hit the bell notification because that will up that will update you every time we upload a new video uh we have so much content coming your way so we hope you enjoy it um yeah so we will see you next friday for a brand new video with me and dan my partner and yeah so bye guys Hey hey guys, so I also forgot to add to this video that I also got a Nando's voucher, £20 Nando's voucher from my godparents, um, so yeah, very yummy because I actually used the card for my dinner on my birthday because we got Nando's, obviously takeaway, uh, but yeah, I used the Nando's voucher so obviously I didn't have it in my bag so I completely forgot to add it to the vlog, but yes, I got a Nando's voucher. And also with the vouchers that Dan got me, the um, eh, what's it called? The Pandora vouchers he got me because he got me two twenty pound uh vouchers to use. Um, so I got a chain like a silver sterling silver chain, and a cephoscope like little charm to add to the chain because I've wanted that for so long. I saw someone on instagram posted that their husband got them it for christmas just gone and i was like oh my god that's so beautiful i really want that and obviously cephoscope to like go with midwifery so i decided to get that with the vouchers um obviously it's not going to come before the video goes up so i'll show you in another vlog um but yeah it's beautiful and i can't wait for it to arrive so yeah but yeah that's it that's all i wanted to add so yeah <laughs>